So as I'm working through collecting my quotes uh, to match my points, I can transfer um, information. Of course, this would be much uh, easier if you can just cut and paste. Um, but what we're really asking you to do is to start to be selective and start to create your outcome. I've said before that if there was a zombie apocalypse, the um, summary table would form your outcome evidence. Now, that's only partially true because the summary table is not really a cohesive argument yet. So what we're asking you to do now is take the information in your summary table and move it into a more cohesive dot point draft. Um, and start to actually, I guess, you're writing your outcome in dot points. Now, this is a really good tool for any sort of complex writing, um, but you might find yourself starting to make decisions about your structure. Maybe writing by focus question is not going to work for you. Maybe you would actually like to group points differently. Maybe uh, if you were thinking about benefits of naturopathy, you might actually need three separate sections. Maybe if you're thinking consequences, you need three separate sections. Well, maybe that doesn't work for you at all. Maybe you need to look at health and then, you know, psychological, whatever. So this is a chance to play with it and get feedback. What's really important is that as a year 12 subject, you only get one draft of your piece. If you give me a dot point draft, it's not your actual work. So I can give you feedback on this, but I need you to actually produce something that you can then use.